of Naira. NLC demands apology from federal government's police for raid and sectarians. These are the major stories on the front page of the Salient Times. To the blueprint, presidency to governors, 573 billion Naira payments second, tranche as COVID-19 and GCARES support scheme. Fund World Bank loan guaranteed by federal government, not grants. Senate denies fixing own salaries, allowances, knocks ex-president to passenger over shocking claims. Uh, another story here says inflation to decline 1.09% July on back of new policies. Bandits ambush troops kill for bond patrol van in Sokoto. And on uh, the master 10,000 agro rangers deployed in 19 states, the FCT. That's according to the presidency. The sports minister apologizes to Nigerians on the outcome during the Olympics. The major stories on uh, the front page of the blueprints. To the first news, reckless, rascally leadership led to Nigeria's Olympic failure. That's according to Peter Obi. And the ICD is Basel's 5 million RH to 82.36% of defunct, defunct uh, bank deposits. Set up to Tinubu, prop $1.5 billion, World Bank loan, $3 billion, Chinese debts. Adeboye condemns flamboyant weddings, blasts makeup users. Bandits ambush Nigerian army in Sokoto, kill four soldiers. Sad one there. And uh, Wakama named the best female basketball coach at Paris 2024 Olympics. I move to the nation. To the nation uh, newspaper. The story here says the presidency replies governors on uh, the 573 billion naira fund. It is a World Bank development loan guaranteed by the federal government. Lawmakers slam Obasanjo over a salary fixing claim. Ulubon charts uh, the ex president. Price court more trips on Lagos Blue Rail Line. Red Line yet to take off. These are the major stories on the front page of the nation. To the Dale Independence, the big story here says 22 commercial airlines close shop in Nigeria in 24 years. Stakeholders say present relatives may not support existing dwarf. Blame the federal government policies on high mortality rate of domestic airlines, least how government can help sustain commercial airline operations. On the invasion of headquarters, uh, the NLC headquarters, NLC accuses federal government of intimidation attempt to gag workers. Ask President Tinubu, uh, President Tinubu to convene conclave to address national grievances. Senate replies, Abbas Anjo says, NAS does not fix lawmakers' salaries. Another story here says, uh, federal government creating another bureaucracy that will be prone to corruption. That's on the local government autonomy. The PDP is reacting as a do APC uh, governorship candidate to present self for public debates. Atiku will be Kwankwase urged to form new party to rescue Nigeria. Well, these are the major stories on the front page of the Daily Independent. To the pointer, now fund loan scheme may elude Delta institutions. That's the big story here. 26,000 TB patients receiving treatments in Delta, Emo, others. NGA urges timely release of funds to combat the disease. Uh, Hamiz, uh, 300,000 compensation to protest the uh, victim. Invasion of NLC headquarters attempt to in intimidate uh, labor force, according to uh, Gerald. The major story is on the front page of the pointer to the pond. Marketers wait as uh, delivery date extended again. That's on uh, Dangote Petrol. Refinery needs 15 cargoes for September, only six cargoes supplied. Police begin trial of 1,135 detained demonstrators. That's on uh, the hunger protest. ICPC reps arrest the uh, top Nakan officials over 90 billion naira hatch subsidy. The major story is on the front page of the punch to the voice of liberty. Lekki government chairman, councillors to enjoy four-year tenure. 
according to uh, the Supreme Court in a landslide judgment. Prob $1.5 billion World Bank loan to states, $3 billion uh, Chinese loan. Sarap Arges Tinubu. It is immoral to fix your salary allowances. Basonjo to the National Assembly. Senate kicks against Obasanjo's immoral benefit allegation. Nigeria in political economic intensive care units. According to Bodhi Judge, uh, indigenous trade group six uh, stake in Nigeria's oil cargoes. The major stories on the front page of the Voice of Liberty to the Platform Times. Southwest leads in 281.47 billion uh, FARC allocations to the local government. Uh, Lagos factory worker jumps into iron melting port, dies. That's a sad one there. On uh, the recapitalization crisis, four banks face identity loss amid CBN's new policy. ICPC groups top uh, NACAN officials over alleged mismanagement of 90 billion naira head subsidy. And why said the bank's report of 70,000 naira minimum wage for car members. So the Niger News directs 17.64% of insured deposits pending due to lack of BVN orders. And the ICA reviews as other customers receive 5 million naira each. Another story here says we're reducing transportation costs by 45% building an economy with CNG initiative in Ogun State. That's the governor reacting there. Uh, federal government unveils my CNG app, offers 50% discount across ride hailing apps. CPP raises alarm under uh, regulation for straightened Nigerian investors. Lagos Blue Line Trail uh, upscale.